Good morning, good morning, and welcome to Monday. Um, I slept so comfortably the last two nights, but the only problem is, is I haven't been able to get to sleep until like after two, but so comfy, especially with new stuffed up, clean, fluffy Rudy. I had a bit of struggles at first because I was having allergies last night, and then also even though I washed him in like a sensitive, unscented, mostly unscented, um, little bit, detergent um I, I he still smelled a little strong for me so i had to like tuck him under my blanket and it was okay in the end but i'm up and moving now it's just about noon i am dressed i despite it looking like i showered because my hair is wet <laughs> the shower is currently pulled apart because the cold water stopped turning on <laughs> and our hot water gets very hot so i just rinsed my hair in the sink because it was feeling super greasy and hopefully later today i can shower also today, plan includes washing laundry. I think that's gonna be two loads. And then, like I mentioned in the last vlog, I want to go pick up some things today. Did I mention this? I feel like I did. I wanna pick up some things today because tomorrow I get my vaccine and I am preparing, I'm hoping for the best, but preparing for the worst. So I wanna get myself some of my favorite comfort snacks in case I feel terrible. So that is the plan today. Hopefully do that sooner rather than later and then come back start taking care of the laundry. I'm feeling still a little like, eh, I was super congested last night. I'm still kind of congested today, um, but hopefully it's just still allergies, hopefully. <laughs> well, hello, it is later. It is 20 after two, so a couple hours. Uh, I ended up going downtown, like I mentioned, to get some stuff, so I picked up some of my favorite snacks for when I'm feeling sick, Pringles, and then just some regular chips, and then I have crackers that I'll bring up from downstairs in case, in case I have just terrible reactions to the vaccine. I'm like, you know, I, I said it before, it's hoping for the best, preparing for the worst, so I also picked up some, I don't, I don't take, um, I can't take pills, I have just, I can't, I can't do it, so I picked up this um, Benelin All-in-One, which is fast relief of pain, pain, fever, headache, etc. things that I think I could potentially suffer from in case I react wonderfully, in case my immune system reacts wonderfully, but my person reacts terribly. Um, so yeah, so I'm just collecting things so that tomorrow will go smoothly. And I picked up a few other things. Oh, I got allergy medicine. My congestion this morning was definitely allergies because once I left the house for like five minutes, I was totally fine. They're coming back now because I'm home because allergies. I need to like dust every three seconds, honestly. It gets so dusty in this room and I think it's probably because we're by like a major road and I have to keep my window open all the time because it's so hot. Like it is 14 degrees outside and it's raining and it is 24 degrees in here. Like why? So currently doing laundry. I have another pile right there waiting for when the other one's done. I mean, technically I could do it all at the same time because there are two washers and two dryers, but they're all different washers and dryers. So I prefer to use the bigger washer and the bigger dryer um, because they just, they work better. So yeah, I'm watching some Among Us up there and I'm chilling and contemplating what to do, thinking maybe transfer some footage from vlogs and like organize things. My biggest problem with not transferring stuff every day is not this camera, but my GoPro, because my GoPro isn't set to the right date, I, I, unless I fixed it, I might've fixed it, I can't remember. So that's gonna be fun, like, wait, what day was that? But other than that, I think we're just mostly gonna chill today. I would, yeah, I think I would love to get everything organized for eventual editing. It's getting close. <laughs> Uh, also to the point that it's getting close in the fact that I'm going to be running out of time like I need to get those up before I go to blind channel and we've got about a month for that so yeah we'll see anyways gonna be a chill day but also trying to get everything in order also like look at him again look how fluffy he is he looks so great oh he looks so good Okay, I now know the damage of me not vlogging or not editing my vlogs for a while. I have 10 full vlogs to edit and they're probably all gonna be about, I would guess like 25 to 30 minutes of raw footage to go through, like after I shrink down any um, time lapses and stuff. So that's gonna be fun. Um, but you know, I'm just gonna take my time eventually start getting through it. I have a load it one up onto my screen as if I'm going to edit it. <laughs> we'll see if I do. 
But the one exciting thing was I did fix the date and time on my GoPro theoretically. It at least said May, so I'm assuming that it's right and that the dates will line up, so that's very exciting. And I've also got my laundry on the bed. And I have 15, well, 16 minutes until I grab the next load. So that's exciting. And then I decided to organize this a little better. So I've got all the colors. I made like 89 in a week. I have problems. Anyways, there's that. I still have to finish those. Future problem. And then I'm putting together my cute little, if I feel crappy, post vaccine uh, basket. I still need to get some crackers, like I mentioned. Oh, I'm just thinking I should have got Sprite in case my tummy hurts. Oh, well, whatever. <laughs> I am gonna be so over prepared and I'm going to be perfectly fine. I know it. Anyways, I think I'm just gonna continue puttering for today, depending on how my productivity levels continue. Um, I might edit vlogs or I might do some more sewing. I feel like I should edit vlogs because I'm real far behind. <laughs> but we'll see anyways that's the current update chilling having a good time doing laundry and um didn't nap i, I thought i was gonna because i was pretty lazy and tired after shopping but i didn't so yay me <laughs> okay <laughs> i have been sitting here editing for some time i stopped for dinner uh but it is currently 8 20 and i'm on to the third vlog that i'm editing which is super exciting but also it's um three of ten <laughs> So I have more to do. And then if you count this vlog, that makes three of 11s. But we're slowly getting there. I don't know when I'm gonna release the first one. It'll probably be soon. Wow, that is some long hair. I mean, I know it's long, but when you like see it, it's long. <laughs> oh my goodness, do I get distracted. Anyways, what I'm currently working on is May 5th, 6th, and 7th because I'm like, oh, I'm not editing my vlogs, but let's make sure that I sometimes vlog an extra day. It's fine, but. I think I'm just gonna continue working on this for a while. Actually, you know, maybe I'll stop because if you can see, I still got a situation over there on my bed that I probably need to deal with before I go to bed and it is getting later. So maybe I will put on a movie. I, I can't get over how long this is. <laughs> maybe I'll put on a movie and get onto that and um, see how productive we can be. But honestly, it feels great to, um, sit back down at my desk with like the setup which I like took me so long to build and get ready and just like ah, and have that I have not streamed also for like at least a month just because like I was so tired and then there was personal things I was going through I just didn't have the energy for it but I'm hoping between now or like for the next month between now and when I go to blind channel that I can get a couple streams in because I've picked up some cute games uh, that I'm super excited to give a try. One is called The Last Campfire, which is just super adorable. And there's another one called, I think it's Lone Tree, which is what I hoped Spirit of the North would be like, but Spirit of the North was so broken. Um, and then other things. So I think I'm gonna try to get back into that soon, but I think the goal for the rest of the night is laundry and then maybe getting the first vlog ready to go for, not tomorrow, but maybe Thursday. We shall see, I guess. I'm not gonna do it tonight, I, like I'm not gonna put it up for tomorrow, so I guess we'll just see how I feel after tomorrow. Like I said, probably gonna be completely fine, but in case I'm not. Alrighty, well, it is later. Wow, my eyebrows, my eyebrows. I had a shower, braided my hair at some point in my eyebrows. Um, <laughs> I've just really been chilling after dinner. Um, I did a little bit more editing. I think I mentioned uh, first vlog is ready to go i wanted to film an intro and put it at the beginning to be like yo i've been missing for two, two for like a month um here's why look forward to backlogs back vlogs <laughs> um and then went to dairy queen we are terrible people <laughs> i mean we're not terrible people but we've been having way too much dairy queen lately but it's so good so did that came home watch dante's peak which i the, i think that's my third time third time <laughs> seeing it now um first time i watched it was in theaters with a friend and her parents and like it was like such a good movie second time i watched it was like probably like four or five years later super late at night by myself and i was like scary movie and then this time i watched it and i was like but like they probably experience a lot of 
earthquakes or like small tremors because of where they're located. Like, why is this new overpass not built to seismic standards? <laughs> it's, it's the trilogy of me watching Dante's Peak. But now it is a time. Oh, it's 10 to 1. I don't know how that happened. And honestly, I just want to eat my Pringles because I'm sure I'm going to be fine after my shot tomorrow, today technically, in like just over 12 hours. I should probably sleep. Um, I really want to eat them because I'm like, I'm totally going to be fine. But in, the, in if I'm not, I want my comfort Pringles. So maybe I'll go have a quick snack before bed, like just a couple crackers. Because I feel like I'm hungry enough that if I don't snack on something, my body will be like, feed me, feed me. <laughs> feed me <laughs> so yeah but overall today I feel like it was a pretty good day like I'm feeling good about the progress I'm making on things and just like good in general <laughs> um but yeah I, I folded all my laundry just to put it away so that's an accomplishment but I did want to put it away just in case tomorrow I'm crappy feeling crappy feeling feeling crappy because like this isn't the most ideal but you know we'll make it work but assuming I am feeling great tomorrow I'm gonna sew some more so so fingers crossed that comes to fruition but yeah for now I think I'm gonna go and I will see you in the morning when I wake up from my lovely sleep in it's gonna be great I've been sleeping so I wouldn't say well because my timing is way off, but like so comfortably, it's been fantastic. I just wake up in the morning, I'm like, mm, feels so great. But it'd be ideal if I could transition the sleep time back a little bit, even like if I can fall asleep at one instead of 2.30. 1.30, I'll take 1.30 and then maybe one, anyways. <laughs> I'm gonna go and I will see you in the morning. Good morning and happy stabby stabby jabby jabby day. That's right, it is a vaccine day. <laughs> it is just about 11. I think I woke up before 10, but I didn't wanna know what time it was, so I didn't check. Um, and I just laid in bed for quite some time. I didn't sleep as comfortably last night as I have been, but it's totally okay. I don't know how long I slept for, I haven't checked. But um, yeah, I am up. I am not dressed. <laughs> I think I'm going to go maybe grab a breakfast drink. Maybe. Cannot decide. And um, get dressed and then we'll see what I decide to do. Because remember, I planned that today would be a do nothing day. So I might just do nothing. We shall see. Alrighty, well it is 10 to 1. Um, I had a quick lunch to something small and so much for doing nothing today because I'm exporting my second vlog of the day. Uh, I did technically edit them last night. I just had to go through and get um, thumbnails for the screenshot. Although technically I still need to get thumbnails for this one. But I was like, you know what? We'll just export it now. Deal with that later. It is, did I say it's 10 to one? It's 10 to one. So very shortly here, I need to start getting ready to go, to go get my stabby stabby jabby jabby, which is very exciting. And I made my bed in case my future involves laying in it. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, you know, I plan to do nothing. So if I end up being completely fine, which I likely will be, <laughs> I'm gonna be like, oh, now I have to do things. But I have sewing projects I can definitely work on and um, editing, so much editing. Because like I said, I think it was yesterday, I have 10 vlogs in backlog and then add this one, that makes 11. <laughs> and I'm not gonna stop vlogging, so it's just gonna keep getting worse. So I'm gonna try to catch up on these. I'll probably either start posting tomorrow, not tomorrow, Thursday or Saturday, depending on how I feel, because um, I don't want to only get like one or two edited and then fall off the face of the earth again. I wanna edit a couple so that I've got a little bit of a buffer before I start throwing them back up on the internet. So that's where we're at. Next time I see you, will probably be post vaccine but who knows um but yeah i'm gonna go and just finish getting ready i need to remember a mask i'm matching scrunchie and mask today you know it's a move got my short sleeve shirt on we should be good oh looky 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 i have been stabbed i'd say more like jabbed honestly it was so quick so i got there a little bit early so we sat in the car for like 10 minutes I went in, I had my QR code on my phone ready to go, I had my health card, went to the first guy, he was too excited, he forgot to check me in, we were like both talking about how excited we were, um, <laughs> so he checked me in, went to the receptionist who double checked everything on my health card, 
scanned my QR code, gave me a little piece of paper, didn't need my health card anymore, went through the line, went right to the nurse, she took the piece of paper, scanned my QR code, confirmed things with me, went over so many things. <laughs> and then she like stabbed me and she's like, okay, you're gonna feel a little pinch. Okay, and you're done. And I was like, are you kidding me? Like, I'm just, the last like major vaccine I can remember is like probably like my grade six booster shots. And like, I remember those hurting so badly, but she's like, yeah, no, it's nice. Cause it's just like, um, it's a really small needle and the vaccine doesn't like sting or whatever. So like, that's nice. But I immediately felt like this arm, which is where I got it. It was like, you know what? That feels different. I don't like that. <laughs> and so I have a feeling it's going to be a lazy arm today, but that's all we've got thus far. I sat there for 15 minutes, came out. I am now home and I think I'm just going to chill because I'm a little tired anyways. I don't know if I was like, I think I was tired before. And so I'm like more tired now or am I the same amount of tired? I don't know. So I think I'm just going to change into some shorts because it is warm in here. Well, it's 26 degrees, but I'm feeling it today. And I'm going to put on a movie and climb to my bed and eat my Pringles because I can now eat them because I had my shot. And then we'll see kind of how it goes over the next little while. But yeah, like I said, like I feel like from about my watch all the way up to here, we're feeling a very lazy arm. It's not like sore or anything. It's just slightly lazy. But that's where, at. like I said, I'm going to change and we're going to chill and then see kind of how Dearish did a day goals. All right, so I ate half my Pringles. My arm hurts. <laughs> That's what that was. Um, and then I laid down. I've been watching Psych, and I was like, kind of ah, in and out of um, consciousness a little bit. I had a little bit of a nap. I don't know if that was just because I was already tired or effects. I think probably a combination of both. Uh, before I fell asleep, it was like arm lazy elbow sore now arm injection site area sore very sore <laughs> I mean not like like I'm not moving it it's fine if I move it though like w once I hit there really sore and any more than that sore so that's fun other than that it seemed to be fine like I said just lazy arm slightly sore elbow and now that very sore so that's great especially because I do like to sleep on my left side so that's gonna be fun um, it's currently a time 10 after 5 so I got home at like 10 after 2 probably um, and I've just been chilling in bed ever since mostly I was up I was texting and whatnot but yeah do not like, do not like that. New development, do not like. <laughs> um, but the aftercare thing says you can ice it, so I will probably do that. I was icing it earlier, well, with this can of pop behind me, because I was like, oh, maybe I'll have a drink of pop to keep me awake, and then I was just like, you know what, this is nice for. <laughs> um, so maybe I'll continue icing it, but yeah, it's rude. Anyways, <sighs> I'm not tired, I don't think, anymore, so I think I'm gonna maybe continue watching Psych. I'm on uh, season four, episode two. Psych is great. I seriously suggest it. Um, and then maybe depending how I feel, depending how that feels, um, maybe I'll do some sewing or something. I don't know. Cannot, cannot be certain, but that's the, uh, <laughs> like three and a half hour update. Arm sore. Okay. So it's about 11 o'clock now. So we're like, uh, the arm. <laughs> We're like nine hours post vaccine shot and really feeling pretty fine. No adverse effects as far as I can tell other than this arm. It hurts. <laughs> it's so mean. So mostly if I'm not doing anything and I can support it at the exact angle that it's happy with, it's fine. <laughs> Besides that, if I move it or anything, it hurts. And so I've decided not to go into work tomorrow because one, I don't really need to. And two, if I was just doing computer work, I think it would be fine. Um, <laughs> but because I actually have to do some physical work and moving things and stuff, it just, I would be so ineffective and it's not really fair to them to make, to, to make them pay me to be like half speed, if that. Um, and two, like, why should I bother coming in if um, I can't work properly? So I'd rather stay home and rest. And hopefully it'll be better tomorrow. But the thing is, is it could be worse. So we will see. But yeah, it's about from, like, here 
down to about here is where it really hurts. So that's great. Anyways, I'm just going to chill. I'm going to continue to watch some psych. It's 11 o'clock. I did edit another vlog. Still haven't like, still haven't like exported anything or done thumbnails, but we're slowly making progress. But I think I'm going to end the vlog here now because it is Tuesday and um, I'll see you tomorrow whenever I decide to drag myself out of bed. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>